Welcome to another Tech Talk brought to you by Frontier Precision. My name is Mel Philbrook and I'm the Geospatial Technical Account Manager for Frontier Precision. In this Tech Talk, we're going to show you how to install Trimble Installation Manager on a Trimble TDC 600 running Android OS. We'll show you how to install Trimble Access 2020 using TIM for Android. And lastly, we'll show you how to use the USB-C cable that came with the Trimble TDC 600 for both charging, but it can also be used for some basic file transfers to get necessary files, GUI models, etc. over to your Trimble Access 2020. So let's get started. Okay, let's now show you the process of installing Trimble Installation Manager and Trimble Access on a Trimble TDC 600. You should see a Google group of icons. Click on that. Click on Google. And then in the search, you can either use the mic or type in Trimble Installation Manager to search for Trimble Installation Manager. You'll be taken to the first link, so go ahead and click on it. And taken to the Trimble Installation Manager landing page where you'll want to click on Tim for Android. You'll want to roll halfway up the page and you'll see a blue link to download Trimble Installation Manager for Android. Go ahead and click on that. You'll see this warning. Go ahead and click OK to download the Trimble Installation Manager.apk. Now that you've downloaded the APK file, you can hit the Home button on your Android device to get to the home page swipe up where there, that lower arrow's at to get to all your apps. You'll see a circle, blue circle, with a folder and click on that icon to get your files. And then in the upper right if you hit folder view you'll see a folder that's called download. Go ahead and click on that folder to see the Trimble Installation Manager package. Go ahead and click on that to start the down, uh, installs, installation of Trimble Installation Manager. Click on Continue. Go ahead and click on Install to install the Trimble Installation Manager. Go ahead and click Open to open. Trimble Installation Manager. Go ahead and allow Trimble Installation Manager to make and manage phone calls. And go ahead and allow Trimble Installation Manager access to photos, media, and files. You can read the license agreement and click Accept. And now Trimble Installation Manager is ensuring you have the latest version and getting all its updates for your serial device. You'll want to click on the globe to install Trimble Access. It will now look at your license and get the, the proper uh, applications available for this Trimble device. In Trimble Installation Manager along the top, just like before, you'll have your versions available. I'll, I clicked on the latest version, which is presently at 2020. And you'll also want to go to Language Files and click on your appropriate language. In my case, it's English. And now it'll download Trimble Access APK. Go ahead and on this warning, click on Settings to allow Trimble Ac Installation Manager 
and allow from this source. Go ahead and hit the back button on your Trimble TDC 600 and then go ahead and now click install in the lower right. Go ahead and click on open to launch Trimble Access and finish up the installation process. You'll want to give Trimble Access access to your photos, medias, and files, so click Allow. And you'll want to give Trimble Access access to your device location, so click Allow. You'll want to read your license agreement and then click OK. And then Trimble Access will launch. Next, we'll show you how to get projects and files or jobs over to your device. But as you can see, once you open a project and open up a job, that the same look and feel of Trimble Access on Windows is the same look that you'll see on Android. So let's show you how to do some basic file transfers. Okay, now that we got Trimble Access loaded on a Trimble TDC 600, one question is going to be, how do I copy files like my Geoid file, uh, a feature code library file, a .fxl file, or a, um, a DXF for an active map background? When you purchase the TDC 600, it comes with a power block and a USB to C cable. If you look at my screen, on the right hand side, you're looking at the display of the TDC 600 connected to my computer. The very first time you plug in that USB to C cable into your device, you'll need to swipe down on your Android device. When you swipe down, you'll be able to see that there's an Android system USB charging this device with a down arrow. If you click on that and you tap for more options, you'll want to change this to transfer files. When you do this, you'll now notice that the TDC 600 has now been set up as a USB hard drive on this device where you can have access to it through File Explorer to copy those types of files. If I now launch File Explorer on my PC, you'll see the TDC 600 is here with the internal hard drive in a Trimble Data folder. And you'll, if you came over to, to see Program Data, Trimble, Geodata, you could go ahead and find the Geoid model that you need. In this case, we could grab G18US GGF, copy that, and place it in the system file folder area, just like I've done for this G12 US. Back in Trimble Data, under Projects, in your project folders, here's where you could also copy job files if you were going to copy a job file from your, uh, from your PC over to your device. And that wraps up basic file transfers to a Trimble TDC 600 using the existing, existing USB-C cable that came with the device. We thank you for watching this and stay tuned for a complete Tech Talk series on Trimble Access 2020 brought to you by Frontier Precision.